All right, it is called garbanzo moly. Yes, garbanzo moly. It's like guacamole, but without all the guilt that comes along with it. Joining us this morning is Krista Arecchio from thewholejourney.com to introduce us to this new deliciousness. Okay, so tell me, first of all, how you came up with this and why. Why not just do the guac? <laughs> because I have to make it complicated. <laughs> no, because I had a lot of clients saying, I'm eating way too much guacamole. When yes. I eat it, I eat half a container. Absolutely. Right? And then they feel guilty because that's like 30 grams of fat. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with the fat in avocado, but you, you just don't want to go overboard. So I came up with combining hummus and guacamole. Okay. Because hummus has complex carbs. So then you have fat and carbs. So you have fiber, carb, and you're full quicker. You don't eat, you know, you end up eating half the fat. Very good. Okay, so yes. tell me about the ingredients that we have okay. here that we're working with. This I'm assuming everything's going to be organic with of, you, right? Of course, of yes. Course. That's given. <laughs> so, seven ingredients. This is really easy. We have garlic. Yes. And I have three. There's, so, there's three cloves of garlic, and I just wanted to show you that you want to pull out the middle stem of garlic so it takes away the bitterness. When you cut it open, oh. pull that out. Okay. Then we do one avocado. And then the juice of half a lemon, which I've already put in the blender. Okay. And then we have tahini. You heard of tahini? Well, only with you before. Ta remind us again what that okay, is. Okay, so this is sesame paste. It's okay. in all hummus. So it's 100% sesame seeds, which is actually the highest food in calcium. Oh, very good. And then one can of garbanzo beans. Organic garbanzo Organic. beans. Organic. And mm -hmm. here's the tip, because a lot of people get bloated after they eat beans. So you have to rinse them really well. Okay. And then I did for a lot of these, but then you want to pull off the, the little shell. shell. If you can, and you have the extra three minutes, you'll get more iron. They are super high and iron and you won't get the bloating. So if you want so to pop the off the shell shells, that gives you the bloating a lot of times? It's the shell that can be hard to digest okay. and so if you can pop those off you'll digest better. Good to know because my 15 month old I give him these and he just pops them, he just eats them like this yeah. but I never know about the shell so that's good to know. Yeah, okay. and so that and he, yeah, that would help him digest it a little better. Very good. And then check this out. So I have the avocado pit mm -hmm. waiting in our bowl because you know how avocado, if you don't eat it quickly, that green turns brown. Right. So the pit prevents it from oxidizing, so you get an extra few days out of it. Just leave it in and put your hummus on top. Set it in there. And then we have a really good quality olive oil. You okay. do one fourth cup plus two tablespoons, and I'll let you go ahead and add the extra two tablespoons. Right here. Yep. Okay. There's two tablespoons of water. I also put a fourth of a cup and two tablespoons already of tahini in there. Gotcha. And then I'll let you put in the sea salt. I okay. love Himalayan pink salt. It is amazing minerals. Okay. And so I have about half of a teaspoon. And if you like more salt, you can do half of a tablespoon. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, very so good. So then we add in the full can. The full deal, huh? The real deal. The real deal. Yes. Garbanzamoli. Okay. All right. Garlic comes next. Very good. And this can be to taste. So again, it's three cloves. And then you scoop in your avocado. Scoop it out. If that's too garlicky for you, you can do two cloves. I, I think it's the Italian in me. I always go I like a lot of garlic, so I think that'll be perfect for Good. me since I plan to eat this. Since <laughs> you plan to eat it. Make sure everybody else eats it too, right? <laughs> Maybe okay. I'll share. Maybe. Okay. So this is a five-minute recipe. I love that. You put that. everything in the blender. And then we're just going to put the lid on the Vitamix. I love the Vitamix or the Blendtec. They're super powered blenders. Okay. All right. So then we're going to turn it on here. There we go. There we go. And then you slowly turn up the heat. You see? There turn we go. Turn it up. And now I'm going to turn on high. And just smash it down. with that, huh? <laughs> Good. Okay, so then, see how fast that was? Love that. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. okay, then stir it up. Stir it up. Now, if you're doing it at home, you obviously give it like another minute or two in the right. Vitamix. But you know, but that's so pretty good. That's pretty good yeah. consistency. So here's your garbanzo mole, or we call it green garbanzo. The full recipe's on this site. And I want to apologize, Erica, for not bringing you chips. Yeah, that was okay? my first thing that I. I know, I know. So here you can try it with a red bell pepper. When I came out, and <laughs> I, the first thing I said was, "Where are the chips?" No, seriously, yeah. where are the chips? So <laughs> I had Brad try a red bell pepper for the first time, and I didn't know if it was going to be you or him. And I thought, "Hey, let's bring him back a red bell pepper." It's delicious. 
Yum, right? I mean, I prefer a chip. Let's be I honest. Know, next this time. Is okay, too. <laughs> I'm going to keep them stashed in my car in case, just in case <laughs> for you. And then how long How long do you keep this? How long is this good for? A couple of days in the fridge? It'll last at least three days. Mm -hmm. You can get four days if you keep that pit in there. Okay, very good. Yeah. The pit keeps it keeps it fresh. It keeps it fresh from oxidizing. And this, so this is a super healthy, you know, good fat, good carb, a wonderful snack that will keep you full for two to three hours after you eat it. I love it. You can use it as a spread on sandwiches or all the above. Yeah. Good. Krista, thank you so much. Krista of offers um, online coaching and we'll put the information up on our screen. It's right there. All the information for you at thewholejourney.com. Uh, We've also got more information on our website. Just go there, fox5sandiego.com. Click on that scene on tab. This is actually really, Raul, really, this is really good. It's really good? Raul's got to try This is really good. Really I'm good? serious. Is I mean, really I, good? I would like a chip. I'm going to be honest, but I'll take this too. Well, Garbanzo Moli, is that what it was? I'll try some, bring me some. <laughs>